Oh, I'm He-Man. I'm gonna go rescue some people. Here I go. Evil warrior, I want you to go and attack He-Man and... Sorry, I do not understand you. Please try again. I want you to go and attack He-Man. You want me to go and attack She-Ra. No, you idiot. I want you to go and attack He-Man. I'm sorry, I did not understand you. Please try again. You can say, attack He-Man. Attack He-Man. You want me to attack Skeletor. Oh, these robots! Do do do. Uh oh. Oh no. Stop right there, He-Man. You can't come any further. Yeah, if you do, we will shoot you with our laser beam sticks. Don't do that. That's so evil. Poof. <laughs> Oh no, my armor. And you too. Zap, zap. Oh no, don't do that. Whew, block, block. I blocked it with my shield. And crah. Oh no, I've I've broken. I win again. Ha ha ha. Don't try to mess with me, Hordak and your stupid Hordak troopers. All right. Hello, hello. Uh long time no film it's been such a long time that since i've made a video i'm gonna open up two and i'm really excited to open up this one because his head is all boing uh okay so i'm gonna open up two horde troopers uh today i haven't made a video in a really long time because i was on vacation and then i was busy and then i was doing all this stuff and then i just didn't have an opportunity um, but I've been really good about staying on my mission and, and behaving myself and blah, blah, blah. Wow, these are so cool. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to get my scissors, my favorite scissors. Got them, got them. Okay, so I'm going to open up this one first and then I'm going to open up this one because I like how his head is all wonky and, and kind of like um, not really, <laughs> oh, it's not even on there at all. I'm excited about this. Okay, for lots of reasons, but the main reason is because, uh, so you go on the internet, the freaking internet, I need to stop going on the internet, honestly, and everyone's like, I want to get a million of them so that I can make an army of them, and I think I got kind of caught up in that, because I bought, I bought two, and now, here's the, here's his package, it's such a great package, he's got a really great package, I love his package, and, um, Here's the back. There's Flying Fist He-Man punching them out. And the back of the card, there's like, I don't know, one, two. There's a million of these horde troopers. So it really lets you know, like, you've got to just buy a bunch of these horde troopers so you can have a horde army. Uh, otherwise, like, it's like having the generic Capri Suns and bringing those to soccer practice. It's like, mom, don't get those. You have to get real Capri Suns. Everyone's going to think we're poor. Some kid told me that at work one day when I worked in a place. Uh, okay, the mindless minions of Hordak use their overwhelming numbers to overpower their enemies. Wow, that's terrible. Press Horde symbol on chest, armor bursts off, and then you can press the armor back in place. So is it just the armor? I thought it was supposed to like fall apart completely, um, like a trash robot or something. Here's the um, these guys that you can buy. I have them, I'm gonna open them someday it's been oh wow and i'm so excited to um uh oh i'm so excited to um open this <laughs> and play with it and 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 break him you know have his armor fall off oh gosh uh oh i'm cutting into the comic book that's a little bit no bueno. No bueno. Okay. So. Wow. Okay, first we gotta do the smell test. Oh yeah, smells like all the rest of them. Okay, and then he's in here. He's got, oh, he's got the, the new and improved little bands here. They're just so tiny. I'm afraid, I'm, this is completely off topic, but um, I'm, I'm a big, I'm a big, um, I'm very pro sleep, so I sleep in a lot, and, um, so I set, like, a million alarms in the morning because I don't trust myself to wake up. I'm surprised that I'm up this early, to be honest. It's 9, oh, no, 841, 841. Um, I'm surprised that I'm up this early. So I set like a million alarms, but then what happens is like, I'll be up 
and they'll just keep going off and I'm like oh how annoying so I'm afraid that one is going to go off while I'm making this video and interrupt me okay so here is the horde trooper I'm not going to press this button yet because I'm gonna well actually maybe I will ready oh actually no I'm not here is his weapon okay wait hold on Okay, well, here's the Horde Trooper. He's out of his package. I'm really excited to have him out of his package because that means I get to play with him now. So this is what he looks like. He looks very intimidating. Imagine if this was coming towards you. Stop right there. You know, he's like chasing after you while you're doing a secret mission and going inside of Hordax, Hordax Lair to try to rescue somebody and he's like I'm gonna get you here I come and you're like no but all you have to do is press this button punch him in the chest Ooh, ooh, it's very firm okay oh mamma mia I wonder if there has to be some type of a oh my gosh I don't know if you can tell but I can definitely oh yeah maybe yeah I'm pressing as hard as it takes to make a little indentation in my finger. Uh, and it's not, his armor is not bursting off. Maybe if I go like this. Here, what about, okay. A uh, little, little bit of a ADHD moment. So they come with this guy here. And let's see. Okay, so the head and the arms, pretty much everything comes off just like everybody else. Okay, so that's pretty awesome, though, because... Oh, man. Ugh, okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't know why that's awesome. It is awesome. Okay, these boots are cool, though. The boots are pretty cool. They're very robotic. Wow. I mean, they, they definitely did a good job of, of including these uh, many, many, many points of articulation. Uh... I really like the silver. The um, the arm, wow, the arm just comes right off. Ugh. And then the head, let's try the head. Oh, the head's going to be hard. You probably have to, okay, so there, so there's his armor, but it, for whatever reason, that button was just kind of a little bit, a little bit cheapo, as we say. Let's try if it, oh no, it's, it still uh, doesn't want to do it. Okay, so maybe there's something that I need to do. So this button looks like it would push push this back, I, I suppose. But I'm not sure why it is not doing that. Maybe it's because it has to go this way first. Or maybe it's because I'm holding the back. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, so when you when you hold it, you don't want to hold the back. So let me see if I can um maybe hold them by the waist. And uh have him pop open that way because I was basically holding him here and that's holding the pieces together so you don't want to you don't want to hold them like this because that will not work I'm holding him by the waist and we'll press there we go wow impressive and then his armor falls off and then those are his bits his his guts and he's like oh no something's happening to me okay so We'll put him aside, and then I just want to open up this guy because, because his head's gonna come right off as soon as I um as soon as I open him, and then there's gonna be two horde troopers guarding Hordak so that Hordak can do all of his evil evil plans, and he'll get away with it because his horde troopers will guard him. And, oh, how terrifying! The evil mechanical enforcer of Hordak. That is so scary. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm totally cutting comic books. Oh, boy. Okay. Round two. Okay, ready? His head's going to come out as soon as I... It's not even attached. I love that. They were... You know what happened? This is what happened. My, um, my hypothesis on what happened is... They were in the factory and they were making these and they were like, no, we just saw on Facebook that some guy in Kentucky is going to order 67 of these because he needs to have a real live horde trooper army. 
so you can be sure that he's not the only person who's going to order 67 of these. So you better get to work making more and more and more of these horde troopers. And then the people in the factory were like, oh gosh, we got to hurry up. And they were just like slapping heads onto things like, fine, it's got a head, put it in the package. And they didn't even try to push it on. Who knows? That's my hypothesis on what happened. Okay, let's grab his little um, uh, laser zapper. It doesn't really say what kind of a weapon it is. Um, but I think I read somewhere. Wow, what on earth? The detailing on this. Is this a, a goblin? Oh, no, it's a, it looks like a, uh, like an alligator. Like there's a wing and then it's got like a body. I see pecs and a tummy and legs and then wings and then a head that's kind of facing up. So that's very interesting. It's a, a laser blasting spear. I'm not, not super impressed by the, uh, by the armor bursting off because it doesn't really exactly burst. It kind of just plops or, I don't know. I wouldn't, I wouldn't exactly call that a burst. I would call that a, hmm. It's not like boing, 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 boing. It's more like think. So, okay. Well, that's neat. How awesome. Okay, so let's try that again. Oh no, I'm a dead robot now. Oh, I've, I've died. Okay. <clears throat> oh, okay, there is heads on. It was kind of like a soft, a, a pretty soft click. Okay, and there, oh wow, this is really cool. Imagine this suit would be really nice because it's, um, if you were a human wearing it, it goes all the way up here, you know, so your neck is not going to get cold if you're out if you're out guarding Cordex Castle in the winter. So that's good. And then maybe if it's really hot, maybe it's got some type of like air conditioning or cooling in there. However, knowing Hordak, probably not. He's not going to give his troops anything to like make them comfortable. He's like, no, you guys are a bunch of stupid robots. I'm not. I'm not spending extra money on air conditioning suits for you guys. You must be out of your mind. Okay. So there they are. Mwah. What? <laughs> okay. So what I really like about it is I, I like the colors. I like the, uh, I really like the silver plastic. Um, I like that they are very intimidating and, and menacing looking. I, the feature with the exploding armor is, is pretty awesome. Maybe needs a little bit of work, but I, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't really anticipate playing with it that much, so I think it's pretty cool and I'm happy the way that it is. Okay, yeah, so I would say like, uh, I don't know, I mean, I'm, I'm just going to give everything a, a 10 out of 10 or an 11 out of 10. Uh, so this is a 10 out of 10 because um, I like the colors, I like that it's silver, I like that it has a cool feature where it explodes apart, and I think that the detailing in the staff is really incredible. It's it's really detailed. I don't know if the if the camera is going to pick it up, and I don't know if it's going to translate well over the internet, but my eyeballs are really appreciating it. I think it's really cool. I think that's my video. Okay, bye.